Hi, this is MJ, and welcome to another episode of Party Planning Shenanigans. Today we're going to be talking about pajama parties. Now for the obvious. The dress code at pajama parties? Pajamas. But you might want to specify what kind of pajamas, just to make sure that your guests don't get the wrong idea. Next up, snacks. You can't go wrong with the classics like pizza, popcorn, chips, candy, and of course, soda. But if you'd like to try something a little healthier, you could always try swapping your soda for water and juice, your popcorn for a variety with less butter, chips for pretzels and nuts, and the rest of your snacks with some simple veggies to dip. Still tasty. Regardless of whether or not your guests are spending the night, you can decorate with cushions, pillows, and blankets. As far as activities, well, it depends on what kind of party you're trying to have. If you're going for a more nostalgic, throwback 90s, you can always play old classic party games like Truth or Dare, Seven Minutes in Heaven, Spin the Bottle, Never Have I Ever, the list goes on. You can also watch some old movies. Disney's are always a favorite. Or you could try playing a board game. I actually made a pajama party board game. If you're interested in looking at it, you can look at the link below and you can download it and play it for free. There are two versions, one suitable for teenagers and one suitable for adults over 21. I'm sure you know what I mean. Feel free to check it out. And finally, if you'd rather just hang back with your friends, play music, and dance around in your pajamas, you can do that too. Note, if you are going to be providing alcohol or having alcohol, you should probably have at least a little bit of water and some snacks available. If you're looking for alcohol ideas, I recommend something light that you can keep drinking throughout the night. Although keep in mind, not everyone will like the same thing. Have fun partying. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.